All right, hello everyone, and welcome to Meet Belief Reviews. I'm Jeffrey. I'm joined by my good friend. Hi, I'm David. And the person off camera, Joe. So today we're going to be doing a uh, three-player playthrough of Lingnum, and I'm going to start off with uh, a teach at the beginning. If someone could let me know in the comments uh, if everything sounds okay and you can hear me just fine. And I'll just open up the chat so I can actually see that. All right. Let's get started. So in Lignum, we are running our own woodcutting enterprises. The goal of the game is to make the most money, just like any uh, worthy enterprise. <laughs> Woo! Some of us will make more money than others. And notice how he's pointing at himself when he yeah. says that. <laughs> uh, so the game is basically broken up into three phases. Uh, you're going to select what area we're going to cut. At the beginning of the game, that's just determined during setup. So we all have equal opportunity for what we're going to be cutting. Then we're going to have a supply uh, path that we're going to go through. And then there's some end of round uh, kind of bookkeeping and, and actions that we're going to do. I find it's easiest to teach the game by starting with what you're going to be doing at the end of the round. Because if I talk about what we're going to be picking up, you're going to be like, well, why would I want that? Why would I want that? So I find it's usually easier to start just with what you're going to be doing at the end. So... At the end of the season of spring, summer, and fall, so we're going to do that three times, and then we're going to have a winter phase, which is a little bit different, and then we just do that same thing for the second year. So at the end of spring, summer, and fall, we're going to cut wood. We have a little foreman that's out in a wood cutting area, and you can use these wood cutters. One wood cutter will allow you to take one wood from here and bring it onto your wood pile. So if I had three wood cutters, I could take all three wood over to my wood pile. The next thing that happens, uh, and I'll get David to move the marker for oh, me, sure. is log driving. So if you had any wood on the river, that's when it's going to arrive. And then the next phase is the transport. So this is where I'll talk about how you get wood onto the river. So there's a couple different ways that you can transport wood. And it all uses these uh, purple bearer uh, meeples. So you can either just have them lug it. I mean, it's a bit uh, labor intensive. So one guy could lug one piece of wood and bring it onto your uh, sawmill board. You could use uh, a cart. So there's these little equipment uh, icons uh, here that you can pick up. So if you have a cart and if you have some fodder, which is the, the screen over here, on the board there's a three and there's a two. So if I had a bear, a cart, and I use this fodder, I could transport all three from my wood pile over to my sawmill board. And then that moves down, so then it's worth two. And then the next time, if I had another uh, cart and a dude, I could use this and get two to move over. When you're moving your, uh, oh, I should also mention the rafts. So there's also these raft uh, equipment tokens. For every raft, you can transport one piece of wood, and you only need one bearer to do it. So if you had a bunch of rafts saved up, you could do a, a big delivery all at once. But the, the trick about delivering via raft is it goes on the river and it stays there for a turn and it won't be till the next season during this log driving that it'll actually arrive and you can allocate it on your board. So when you deliver your wood to your sawmill you have a choice to make. You can either put it in your sawing era, uh, area so you can cut it up or you can put it in your sale area so you can sell it to make some money. Once you've made this decision that's final. You cannot rearrange uh, any of this. So at the moment that it's delivered, you have to make that, uh, that choice. So let's just say I, I did that. The next phase is the sawing phase. So you're going to be able to turn these uh, pieces of wood into milled pieces of wood, which are the, like the log looking ones. And the way that you do that is you need a saw, so these gray guys. You need a saw, which is another piece of equipment that you can, uh, that you can get. And then you're going to be able to turn one of these pieces of wood into its milled version. And there's a little handy dandy uh, cheat sheet here. So firewood gives you four. Uh, softwood, which is these brown uh, ones, will give you three. And then hardwood only gives you one piece. And then you have another decision to make when you do that. You can put the uh, hardwood into your firewood storage. And I'll talk about why you might want to do that later. Or you can then transfer it down to your sale area so that you can then uh, sell it. The next phase is the task phase. So we're going to be able to get these different task cards. So think of them as deliveries that we're going to be able to make. 
which are going to be worth money at the end of the game. So at that time, you're going to be able to assign wood to those. Or uh, we're playing with the two expansions, a uh, little mini expansion. So there's the joiner and there's the buildings. The joiner, you can assign some wood over here also during that phase, but I'll go a little bit more into that uh, later. And then the last, uh, well, second last here is the selling uh, phase. So you can sell anything here in your sale area. And the amount of money that you're going to get is listed here. So uh, I won't say what all it is, but basically firewood is the least valuable, softwood, and then hardwood is the most valuable. But you can't sell an unmilled piece of hardwood. You actually have to cut it up first before you're able to sell it. Then the next thing that's going to happen is the drying phase. So on your little uh, board here, you can have space for two milled pieces or one unmilled piece. So if you have anything here, you can move it over uh, one space each time the drying happens. So if you had, let's say, like this and drying occurred, this would move over here and then that would move there. Once it gets to here, the sale price is boosted by one for each uh, good that you have here. And then once it gets here, it's boosted by two. So I could sell this piece here for three, which is the base plus two, so five bucks, making some more money. So the more you hold on to something and let it dry out, the better it's gonna be uh, be worth. A few comments in there, I don't know if any are in the volume. So, oh, we actually have the designer has joined us. Hello, everyone. Uh, and, great, you're doing this live stream. Thanks so much, and good luck. I think uh, Dave's gonna need the luck. Of the yeah, yeah, no, please stay tuned and help me out on my turn. That would be fantastic. <laughs> Yes, uh, and someone said they're glad that we're playing with the expansion. I I think the expansion is pretty easy to to incorporate and well, adds a little bit. And we should variety. add, we should add because we're playing on the capstone version of the yes. game, which is yours. And I had the original version of the game, and when you came over, I had the original version set up, and it didn't have the expansions in it. We just tore it down and then reset up with the capstone version. So yeah. definitely, the capstone version is preferred play for us. So I just went through everything that's going to happen at the end of each of spring, summer, and fall. Uh, so before that happens, we're going to select what areas we're going to cut in. Uh, at the beginning game, like I said, that's just standard setup. But then we're actually going to go through the supply path, and that's how we're going to get all the items that we're going to need to use at the end of each season. So in order here, somebody's going to be able to move as far forward on this path as they want to take something. But here's the, the rub. Uh, you can never move <laughs> backwards. So if you skip over something, you cannot go back and pick it up later. You can only ever move uh, forward. I guess there's so many people on this supply path that it's just hard to turn around and, yeah. uh, and walk backwards. So there's a couple of these little spaces here that'll be seated with equipment. So if I stop here, I simply pick up the cart, I put it in my equipment storage area, and, and that's it. Pretty simple actions. We have some saws. Uh, I'll just go over all the little ones. We have, you can pick up a coin, you can pick up some food, uh, there's some building materials, these orange ones, which I'll talk about later. You have a, a sled, some rafts, so I mentioned transporting here. You could, this is where you're going to pick up the rafts, as well as the carts that you can use for transport. You're going to pick up uh, there as well. Now, I mentioned you use the bears during the transport. You can come here, you can pay $1 per bear, and you take them and you'll be able to use them that round. One thing I will mention is you can't really keep uh, the workers from season to season. They're kind of transitory workers. So if you pay for them and then don't end up using them, they go back anyway. So you only want to pick up what you're actually going to be using for that season. Here, uh, we'll need an extra fodder for a, uh, for a three yours player. Is actually with this oh, sorry. Yeah. So here, there's two fodder available. You can pay a dollar. You can pick it up. It goes into your three number three slot. So that's how you're going to use that in conjunction with the cart to do some, some transporting. There's a planned work uh, area. So there's these five cards that are randomly set up at the oh, beginning of the game. David, it's first. Oh. oh. Just bear with us, the camera froze. Was it left? Or right click. Right click. And go audio. Yeah. Do you want me to change it to 780? Oh, I'll do that after. Okay. That should be good. Yeah. So over here we have some planned work. If you go here, you have these three sets of tokens, a one, a two, and a three. So this is how you're going to be able to set up some bonuses for further uh, rounds. So if I use my three, I'm planning work for three rounds from now. 
So there's a, a bunch of different ones. I won't go through them now. As people take them, I'll explain what they do. But just know that some of them can cannot be used in winter. So here you see this has a little blue icon that can be used in winter. This one here cannot be used at that, that time. There might be a cost associated with this as well. So if there are any tokens on the card, you need to pay $1 per token on there. So if you're the first person to get there, you get it for free. And money is pretty tight, uh, especially in the early game. So saving a dollar on something is really good. Here, this is where you're going to be able to hire the woodcutters. So $1 per woodcutter that you hire. And you can hire a maximum number of woodcutters equal to how much wood is in the area where your foreman is. So here, I could hire a maximum of three guys. And again, that's how you're gonna be able to move these from here over to your, your wood pile. Uh, the buildings, we have some up here. You just get to take one and put it on your building board. It's free to take, but you're limited to only having two buildings uh, throughout the game, and it's frozen again. Uh, just bear with me, I'm just going to change the, the stream one second. If we're in lower res, it'll be good, so then they'll see the destruction that goes on over here. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, it'll be yeah. more fuzzy. Yeah. <laughs> that way, when Jeff wins, it won't be as clear. Yeah, that's yeah, right, yeah. Exactly, yeah. It'll be a foggy victory. Yeah. Asterisk next to it. Sure. <laughs> Sorry about that. It's just my computer's not that great, so it can't really run 1080p. I was hoping it would, so I just had to decrease the resolution a bit. So we were uh, talking about the buildings. Again, I'll go over them as people take them, what their special abilities are. They're free, but you can only have two during the game. Here, you're gonna be able to take these task cards that you can uh, fulfill throughout the game. It costs $1 to take a task card. You'll notice on these task cards, this is how much it's gonna be worth at the end of the game. But some of these pieces of uh, wood have a plus one or maybe even a plus two associated with them. So when you fulfill them in the task phase, they need to come from the associated drying uh, area on your board. Then we have the joiner. So this is the other mini expansion in the game. Again, he's free to take. Woo, pretty good. You have to take him, he'll go over on your little joiner board. He provides you $1 at the beginning of every turn. Pretty good, especially in a game where money's gonna be pretty tight. The rub though for him is that when we feed in winter, so we're going to have a food requirement, we have to feed him as well. So it increases our requirement by one food per joiner that we have. The other benefit that he has is you can assign a, a milled piece of wood that's plus one. And at the end of the game, you're going to be able to sell that for an additional $3 over what it's, uh, what it's worth. The next place here is where you're going to get the sawyers to use with the saws to actually cut up your wood. There's one guy here reserved for each of us for free, so you never have to worry about losing out on one of these guys. But there is an extra guy here that someone's going to be able to hire for one dollar, uh, so you can get a little bit more sawing done potentially. And then finally, the last space here is the market, where you can buy saws for a dollar. So over here, you can pick one up for free, or you can buy one here for a buck. You can also pick up food along the way for free or you can buy it here for one dollar uh, a piece and then there's also these uh, these construction tokens you can turn in a set of a like token for two four or six dollars for two three or four of the same token but you might want to hang on to these uh, tokens because what you can do is there's a little hut construction so if you get three of the different construction types not this uh, thatch that's only good for for selling in the game you can form uh, three huts which give you special powers. So when you, anytime on your turn, you can turn these three in, you essentially just turn them over to get three tokens. You can assign them up here to your hut effects, which allow you to do some, maybe some extra drying, take some food from a free cutting area because we're gonna seed uh, this randomly throughout the game, or potentially use it as an extra mill worker. Now you'll notice we each have a worker of our own color on our board. He's a wild that we can use each round as either a bear, a woodcutter, or a sawer. So you have a little bit of flexibility. And he's free. You don't have to pay for him. He's an indentured servant. <laughs> <laughs> and then finally, we get to here. Once everyone is here, we go into the woodcutting phase. 
Now, the reason why you might want to jump further ahead uh, than other people is because in future uh, rounds, at the beginning, we're going to select what region we want to cut wood at. So we have these tokens that are numbered. We're all going to secretly choose, and then we're going to reveal. If you are in the same area as somebody else uh, when uh, during a round, the person who gets to the end first is going to get to cut the wood there first. So there might not be anything left for you, but have no fear. You can pay an extra buck to move your guy to another uh, to another area. But again, money being tight, you might not want to uh, to do that. So you might jump over some tasty stuff to get a little bit further. Tasty wood. <laughs> so that's so we do a selection. We do the supply path, and then we do this end of round, uh, end of season uh, steps up here. We do that for spring, summer, fall. Then the winter is going to be a little bit different. At the beginning of winter, we get a piece of wood of our choice to our wood pile. Then we don't do the supply path in winter. So really, all you have is your mill worker plus any huts that you've built during the game. And you have a couple options of what you can do with them. You can get two extra firewood to your wood pile. You can use sleds to transport wood. So you need uh, your mill worker, a sled, which you can pick up uh, during the supply path runs. And then you can transport two pieces of wood. But you can increase how much wood you transport by paying uh, extra food up to a maximum of three more wood for three more food to pay. You can do some sawing uh, here. In the second year only, we're going to be able to sign wood to tasks. Then we're going to have to feed and heat our, uh, our little enterprise. So there's a first winter card and a second winter card. So for our first winter, we're going to need six food. So that we'll need to pay. And then for the heating, we're going to need three pieces of firewood storage. So that's where you might want to put your firewood up here so that you can pay for it in winter. You cannot use the wood in your cell area to heat your, uh, heat your house. And then in the second year, we have seven food and seven heat that we're going to need to do. Um, and then, then we just go back. We do the same thing in the second year. Whoever has the most uh, money from cards, from leftover money, and plus at the end, we're going to get to do a final sale uh, of everything. Whoever has the most money is the winner. Woo. Awesome. And that's that's like now. Let's get started, shoot we? So let's get uh, get started. We've already randomly uh, set up. And we um, all start with five dollars. And we all start with five dollars. So we're gonna turn this five dollars into a lot more cash, hopefully. <laughs> well, you will. Yeah, <laughs> yeah maybe. <laughs> At least one of us. I'm gonna turn this into this. some yeah. loans, and yeah. uh, so I'll just reset this here. Okay. I think everything is good to go. All right. So I am going to. Do I go for a cart right away? Yeah. Let's do. Let's do a cart. So I just move there. I take the cart. I put it into my equipment. I'm going to grab a saw because it seems like I'm going to need to cut some wood eventually. Yeah, a saw is always a good thing to have. Okay. So now I can go to the bearer part. Let's actually... I think I'm going to skip over the bearer. Oh, you took the dollar I wanted. So I take that. I get an extra buck. Well, when you have the cart in hand right away, it gives you a few options. You know, because there's another cart there's down cart here. There, yeah. But if Joe gets there ahead of me. For a dollar. Looks like I need a bear. <laughs> <laughs> and it goes into the three, correct? Yep. Yeah. And as long as you have a fodder in the three, you cannot purchase any more fodder. Okay. Mm -hmm. oh. And is everything sounding uh, all right? You can hear us just fine? You guys will need to get the. So I will take pay a dollar for one of these guys. So the other thing to notice is it always goes in this turn order, not based on who's further behind. So it's not like you get to go multiple times if you're behind. It always goes in uh, turn order. So I will go here. I will pay a buck. I will get a fodder. So I got my cart. I got my fodder. You're good to go. I'm good to yeah. go. Yeah. Okay, my turn. Mm -hmm. Food's always a good thing in this game. So let's see, what do I want to plan here? Oh, you're planning something? Maybe. Yeah. <laughs> let's let's try it. So I'm gonna go to planning work. 
I'm going to take my number two token. So I go two uh, seasons from now. I'm going to put it on this card right here. So it's free because there's no other tokens there. So in that phase, when I'm sawing wood, one saw and one saw allows me to cut two uh, pieces of wood. Very nice. And someone said the audio is good, so that's great. Okay, I'm good. I'm going to need one of these guys to... You need one per wood that you want to chop. One per wood that I want to chop. Okay. So I should mention this is uh, my eighth, oh, ninth play of the ninth game. Play. David's fifth, and this is Joe's very first is it, very no, this first is my play. Sixth, is sixth? It? Yeah, my sixth play. Yeah. And so... So yeah. you're seeing a whole lot of different uh, yeah. play experience. I'm going to go here pay a dollar and take just one. So that means that you'll only be able to take one piece of wood from here, and if you use your mill worker, that'll only be two. Yeah, maybe I'll, but I'm gonna need to. Oh no, I get a free saw. But see, I'm only gonna be able to saw one. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Anyway, so there's no there's no value in taking. But it could just be here waiting, and or you could, because the other thing too is you can sell it without milling it. True. I'll take two for an additional work because I I think it's best to use the money I have now in this first yeah. round. Get it invested. Think like yeah. you're running a business. It's it's just like 18xx, right? Yeah, this is this is very similar to an 18xx game. Well, you um, guys are all planning work early. Well, you know what? My first couple of games that I played this, I always put off planning until the second year, and then at that point in time, is usually too late. And yeah. so so now, just as a matter of course, I'm going to go there first round. I'm just going to do lay down my three see for what examples. Happens. Yeah, 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 just see what happens. And then also, you can get it for. Usually you can find something, you can work around somebody for less. So you know what I think I'm going to do is um, I'm going to get in on this hardwood. Like I just want to make sure I lock that down. So one, two, I'll get him in winter. Yep. Oh, there we go. All right. And so, so that one is just he gets to take a hardwood and put it onto his wood pile. And hardwood, like I said, is very valuable. Every single task card requires at least one piece of hardwood. Mm -hmm. And it's very limited in where it comes up here. And I'm most familiar with the two-player game, but for the three-player game, do we flip over two? We flip over two, two cards. Oh, yeah. interesting. Okay. So next is going to be me. I'm going to go here. I'm going to spend three bucks. I'm going to get three of these guys. Okay. I will... Oof. I'm going to take a task straight out of the gate. I think I am. Yeah, we're gonna take a task and give myself lots of time because I don't fulfill these. It, uh, all that matters is at the end of the game. Yeah, you can fulfill them little bit by little bit. I'm gonna take that. Oh, that task. I'm gonna put it up next to your wood pile. Put it up here. Yeah, maybe slide it over a little bit. There we go. Okay, Michael. Yeah. Um, I will go here as well. And this is where the AP starts settling, settling in because you're trying to figure out what, what, how many sawyers you're going to get. Yeah. Are you going to use that guy to do this? Does this? Um, so I think what I'm going to do those. I think I want three of those guys. I think I want them, uh, and that will give me like a saw and bear. Yeah, I will buy three of those. Back to you, Jeffrey. Back to me, hey? Well, the thing I like about the first round is nobody's in the same area as me, mm -hmm. so I don't have to worry about rushing uh, to the end. Yeah, we should say Jeffrey and I just played a two-player game earlier this morning, and of all the rounds, all but one round, we chose the same spot yeah. to, to go to. Uh, so let's just get a slide. Okay. Get a card. I guess I could have jumped ahead and picked that card up and kind of blocked you. But you know what I'm going to do for... See, I'm only going to be able to chop two of the, the wood, really, right? I'm going to pick up a building here. You got first dibs on a building. And you know what? I'm thinking... like in, This is always a good um, tile to have with more players because more of these tiles get out there, and that saves me some money. But I was thinking of doing something a little bit different, but I don't know if it'll actually pay off. Oh, this will help me out in two more occasions. Oh, uh, the joiner should be back there. But I like this guy. I, I have my sight set on him. I don't know why. I'm just gonna I'm gonna give. I go with it. I'm gonna I go wanted with it. that one. Man. Yeah, I'm gonna go with it. So, so, let's see. Is there any building out here that's immediately gonna be useful to me? I don't think so. But the other thing to think about too is, I'm not in a rush this turn. No. So I might as well pick something up now because maybe next round I am going to be in a rush and I don't want to take that time to stop yeah. uh, and do that. So let's go here. We're going to go ahead and uh, 
We're going to take the office. So this one is at the end of the game. Uh, for each task card that I have, I get an extra buck. So basically you're getting a task for free. Uh, in, in in the overall grand yeah. scheme. Of it. Yeah. I, don't have, I, I still have to pay at the moment, but, but I get a dollar of, back. Yeah, you get it back. Okay. Uh, I am going to... So the joiner is free. The joiner is free to take for mm -hmm. for now. <laughs> but he will give you he'll give you one dollar at the beginning of each spring, summer, and fall. But during the winter, you have to pay an extra worker, extra for, food, or extra food for him. Yeah. So he gives you five bucks, right? If you take him now, and you only have to pay essentially two dollars worth. So you're making a good investment. Yeah. Yeah, and a good cool thing with the joiner is there's only one, and that's uh, the same for all player counts. So with higher player counts, he's I'm going to take him. See what good. happens with him. Hopefully I can afford the, the food he's going to need. Yeah. <laughs> I'm just going to pick up what's available to me. And uh, someone said that the last time they were played, they were all cursing at each other Yeah. Uh, for taking spots. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> well, well. so hold on. We, we actually have to filter ourselves as if our kids were around. Yeah. You know, that's yes. the filter we're yeah. applying right now because definitely there's more adult language used when we're not on the... Um... That, that always makes me realize that I enjoy a game when I'm cursing at my opponent for... Well, yeah, well, yeah but the next level of enjoyment is when you're cursing at yourself, right? Yeah. You, you, <laughs> then when you actually start reflecting within is the... You're skipping oh. over the task. Oh, he got that. that uh, see, I took the joiner thinking that I might still be able to get that one next time. It, but that uh, more of those will uh, will show will up. Will show up, yeah. Um, so I'm going to come here. May, I, I think I'm going to need a, a sword. And it's free. And it's free. So. Yeah. Did you want to buy the additional fella? I don't need that dollar for anything else right now, but am I going to... I'm going to get... See, I'm not gonna be able to bring them. You're not gonna be able to buy yeah. two saws. Yeah, and the problem is that if you pay a dollar for him, then you still need to go buy a saw to use him, which yeah. you don't have. So. Yeah. so the other thing that I did mention is there's loans in this game. Mm -hmm. So you can take a loan for four dollars, but you're gonna have to pay back seven uh, at the end of the game. So, and you can do that voluntarily or maybe not so voluntarily, as David has uh, learned. <laughs> yeah, we played one game where maybe the designer is still on here. Is we played one game where the loans couldn't even cover what I owed. Yeah, uh, and so then we're like, uh. <laughs> and in a game about planning, that just indicates very poor. Planning. Very poor yeah. planning. Very poor planning. So I'll pay a dollar for uh, the task. Of, Which one? Which um, one? Yeah, I'll take that one, please. Because you know how much I love drying wood. So yeah. I'll, I'll put him. Is that visible? There That's we good. go. Put him up there. Uh. So then back to me. Uh. I'll go pick up my SAR. And this goes. Just oh, the... Yeah, so what you do is we'll give you a food oh. and then just keep that, give that, put that token to the side there. And the food goes. goes in your food storage below your fodder over to the left. left. Oh, right, yeah, there. right there. Yeah, the big food storage. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> you know, <laughs> with the matching green yeah, uh, yeah. tokens. Okay, uh, my turn. I will go here and I'll pick up my dude. Yeah, someone mentioned there is a limit of two loans, and they get so you can only take two. Yeah. Uh, and they get progressively worse. The first one you take, you pay back seven. Yeah. If you take another one, you got to pay back sixteen. Uh, yeah. At the end of the game. And how much total cash does each loan give you? Is it four bucks? Four bucks a piece. Yeah, four bucks. So. So it's a good exchange rate on the first one, yeah. almost a hundred percent interest. Yeah. But the next one is. Uh, four hundred percent. Is is one hundred percent interest because you get a total of eight bucks, uh, but you pay back sixteen. And but the thing is, it's not like some other games, say like Agricola, where taking a loan is detrimental, completely detrimental. Here, it actually can still be used. In, yeah, if you can use it at the right time, so yeah. that you can get everything accomplished that you want, like. The last game we played, I took a loan, yeah. and I ended up winning, yeah. because it allowed me to do some extra stuff at the time I took it. Yeah. yeah. So okay. who are we on to? Um, I just got my Sawyer. So it's back to Jeffrey. Uh, let's go up here. We'll take a raft. I don't think I need anything in the market. You got your saw? You I got, got my saw. saw. I got don't my... need food until yeah. the end? Get some thatch. Might as well pick, pick it up. There's no harm in taking that, right? Ugh. So here's the thing that, uh, so I, I cannot choose to go here because there's nothing I can do there. Right. So I must go You could take a loan to buy something. I could, I could, but I, I don't have the foresight to appreciate <laughs> what a loan will do for me at this current state. Um, and I have no money left. See, I was really hoping that uh, you would have gone here, done something, like buy a saw. You sure you don't want to buy a saw? I'm positive. Uh, because then I could have gone here and then come in last so I could be first for the next so, turn So the order. other thing is the order that we arrive here, the reverse of that is going to be the turn order for the next round. Yeah, so my whole plan... I appreciate the offer, but no. Yeah, I so I can't go here. There's nothing here. I can't go here because I can't take the action. So I'm obliged to go here. Yeah. Then it's yeah, back that's, to That's me. unfortunate. It's very unfortunate. I will go there. And I will go here. 
Oh, All right, bummer. so then we go into the this phase track where we go cutting first. And this can all be done uh, simultaneously. So I have three woodcutters. I'm going to cut three wood, taking these three. I will cut two over to my wood pile. Go to wood pile. The next log driving, nothing arrives because we've done nothing there. Now we go transport. So I'm going to use my uh, mill worker as a bearer, my fodder, and my cart. Uh, so that allows me to move three down. I'm going to put one in my saw and these two in my selling area. So I'm going to I'm going to do this. I only will unfortunately use it for two. Yeah. of the of the possible three. See man, if you would have bought that one extra wood cutter. And you know, for, first time playing for first time. Right. Um, and then so I can choose where to put so it. You can choose where as, to put it. Okay. But if I want it cut, I need to put it here so I can yeah. cut it and then dry it. And right? you want to make sure that so one thing to take into consideration since it's your first play is you're going to need money for the next supply path. So, so I you, probably will need to sell it. Yeah. yeah, just so you get that little bit of extra cash so that you can actually buy some stuff, you yeah. know, so you can keep re reinvesting. Absolutely, yeah. All right. Uh, and then, then we go to sawing. So I'm going to use my saw. Oh, no. That was poor planning. You, you don't have a saw? I meant to stop here to pick up a... Uh, no, you don't have a saw. Oh, oh, so yes. so viewers, what should we do? Jeffrey, what play is this for you right now? Number nine. Ninth this play, is, gonna, first round of the ninth play. I'm going to chalk play. this up to uh, live stream. Oh, <laughs> being nervous, <laughs> being nervous. <laughs> stage fright, yeah. stage fright, Jeffrey. Uh, so um, I will let, leave it up to my... However, uh, however, I, maybe I should say, by you going there, you would have... Uh, I'm trying to think come, where... I would have come uh, behind last. Me. Yeah, you 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 would have arrived last still. Yeah, uh, like so. Oh no, well, well, I I'm currently last, so Jeffrey would have been behind me. Yeah, so so yeah, Jeffrey would have been here. You still would have taken that action, and I still would have ended up yeah. first. So it would have the order changed. Yeah. Have changed. But no impact yeah. on you. So really. Yeah. So then, so then, so uh, then, too bad. Sorry, Jeffrey. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so, so how to change the order? Down. Yeah. How to well, change the order here? Oh, like, okay. I I think we have a few comments too on what we should do with you. Yeah. Oh, the saw, yeah. yeah. <laughs> so, uh, uh, I, it's, it's fine. I, so, should we let the viewers decide? I think yeah. it's fair to let the Who viewers decide. Who thinks they should let me We gotta do it like uh, old Roman style. <laughs> yeah, you know, yeah, which, way do we, which way do we choose? <laughs> oh, Jeffrey. Uh, um, I'm cool if you want to do a mulligan on that. I really no, I, I think yeah. let's let's see how it plays out. Okay, see I mean, see I, how punishing this game. Yeah, can I, I, make I made a, some I made some poor planning. We'll, so we'll see how. If it was goes. your first play, then maybe like yeah. like you know you should give me slack because it's my yeah. first play, but you maybe not so much. So now I'm gonna be super focused. Uh, yeah. Oh wow! Like, yeah, so no, Jeffrey will be providing no more commentary for yeah. the rest of the game. As he <laughs> gets laser focused on what he should do. Um, we may have pissed him off too early though. Now. <laughs> yeah, I, I will use. Yeah, I will use a saw and a sawyer, and I'll chop this guy up into four. Think of it as a handicap for me. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, so I'm, I'm gonna use a saw and a sawyer and uh, chop up that one. That one into, into four, four pieces. Mm, so I will. I will not. So. At any point in time, are you allowed to move these over? So now, no. now when you saw, you make the decision. Is that oh, a firewood okay. or a sail? Is that firewood or sail? And, and you got you lots can only of put time. Two there, right? Uh, you can put as many here. Oh, but you can only but you dry can only two, two at a time. So since we have lots of time to build up the firewood, I don't necessarily need it right now because yeah, we only it, need three, and, right? Yeah. And the other option too, don't this card here for planning is sweet because you can take a firewood and chop them into six well, as opposed that, to four. That's the one that I'm I'm looking at maybe. And so there's still time to plan for the first winter if that's yeah, something yeah. that's exciting for you. Uh, so then task phase is anyone assigning anything to a task card? Uh, uh, I cannot. No. Not okay. At this point. Then we go on to sale. Um, yeah, this kind of kind of sucks here. I will sell at least one for three bucks. I'm gonna sell this one for three bucks. And I'm contemplating: Do I let this one dry a little bit? Um, I can only dry two of them, so I'm actually gonna sell these two for a dollar each as well. So for two I'm dollars. selling these for five dollars total. Yeah, I think I will. Man, I really messed up. I will sell this one for three. Should we be enjoying your mess up as much as we are? Yes. We will off camera. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It'll be a chest bump time. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> All right. Uh, then we go to drying. If anyone has anything to dry, move over. But we should tell the viewers it's because Jeffrey beats us all the time. Right. So yeah, this We're is, this is a, yeah this. Th yeah we are so enjoying we this maybe too much to yeah. the next phase. Yeah. So then we seed the board. So it's always uh, the same sorts of things. There's three random construction three materials. Uh, yeah, I'll take this. There's two saws. Oh. And we take these back, correct? Yep. 
two cards. Do you want to seed the board with the cards? Uh, yep. One sled, and then over here, and then two rafts. I'll just sit here and look pretty while you guys do all the work. Oh, okay. so you you're off camera, Joe. I'll just poke my, oh uh, no, my face is on there. Oh. Interesting. So to confirm, it's two cards for a two player, a three player game. Yep. Okay. Yeah, because we played that one game where I was still playing it like a two player game and we were only picking one card. We're like, how come there's no resources out there? That's we a, did that you see? Uh, yeah. Okay. I wonder where everyone's going this time. <laughs> now, the other thing I should mention, after you finish seeding these cards, for any area that doesn't have any wood on it, then you'd provide it with okay. one firewood fire um, oh. additionally. Like so. I'm just going to move these off camera now that oh, okay. people have seen, so okay. then I have a place for my oh. uh, task. Oh, I was first. trying to limit your ability to do things. Uh, and then, so in the reverse order, so it's going to be orange, then blue, uh, then red. No, no, no. I already starting. Oh, I, you, I, I you already did it? this. Yeah. yeah. So, so it'd be red, blue, orange, because you got there last. Right. Yeah. And I got there first. Well, that, that's on blue. Yeah. No. Joe, I got there last. Oh yeah. Okay. So yeah. Yeah. So we're right. We're we're good. Um. So now we got to choose where we're gonna go chop some wood. Don't forget saws this time. I'm not yeah. gonna forget <laughs> saws this time, buddy. So now, the thing I like about this phase is it kind of sets the pace for this entire supply path. If you're off by yourself, you don't have to worry about someone beating you there and cutting that wood before you. But if you're the same as somebody else, then uh, you might be a little bit more pepping your step mm -hmm. as you go. The other thing I should mention, so this has food in these areas. If you go here and you're the only one, you get all the food that's there. If multiple people go there, you split it evenly. If it can't be split evenly, whatever's left over just stays there for the next round. Oh. Where are you going? I know where you're going, and I've chosen the same place, Jeffrey. I think we're all going to the same one this time. Oh, well, now that I know that, let me change. You messing <laughs> with me? I am. Yeah, yeah. Um, so I'm Joe's ready. a wild card, not having played with him. Yeah, we um, don't know... Uh, before. His tendencies. So I don't know my own tendencies. So <laughs> <laughs> you guys are in trouble. Because I kind of got off to a bad start, I'm gonna play it a little bit safe. I think I'm gonna go somewhere where no one else is going. All right, you ready? Reveal two, six, oh. six. Hey, buddy. Oh man, I could have went to four. So neither one of us get the food. Okay. Yep. And then that's that's it. So you guys are potentially going to be in a race. Mm -hmm. but that's okay though, because if like it's only a dollar and you get to come over here yeah, to correct. a pretty so yeah, one thing to this place has six wood, right? Yeah. Uh, but you're limited into how many woodcutters you can buy based on the current area where you are. Yes. So you can't like oh I'll let him get there first. I'll take six woodcutters, move over here and take it all. No, of course, mm -hmm. yeah. And it may be though because I don't have to move. Suppose you got there first and chose only cut two. I you might be happy with just, just those two. two. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah, I don't have to move. Yeah. Okay, so, so I go first. Drill, yeah, yeah. Get the saw. <laughs> oh, it hurts. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Oh yeah, these guys come back on. I don't really know how I should be using the joiners yet. I have to oh, and you should get up. one dollar at the beginning of the oh, round yes, for the joiner. Yeah. Uh, and we should get two more fodder out there. Oh yeah, sorry. And uh, yeah, so no, I don't know how I'm going to use the joiner. This is uh, this is pretty rough. Not going to lie. <laughs> So I think I'm just going to jump to here, and I'm going to pay $1 to get one one single bear. Well, I'm going to be happy with my lot in life and just uh, pick up. It's not up. a lot. Yeah, <laughs> not a, yeah it's, my, it's my lot, but it's not a lot. So you have unlimited... Equipment storage, but the one thing that you are not unlimited on is saws. You can only ever have a maximum of four of them mm -hmm. uh, at a time. But everything else you can have as much as you want. I'm after you, right? So my turn? Yeah. Yep. Okay. Get a bear. Get one of those guys. Hmm. Uh... Okay, I don't think I need a fodder this turn, so I'm just going to jump to here and grab this guy. Nice. And you're down to two fodder. With only four dollars. 
Yeesh. So I'm gonna, ooh, I'm orange. Zip on down to here, and I will use my one planning to go here and for here. David. I knew you guys wanted to go there, so I figured it'd be fun if I got there first. Cause that's always such a good one, that firewood that one. It's always one. A, a good one. Especially for someone like me who has horrible planning and this game's all about planning, that kinda helps, you know. Hey man, mitigate. I forgot to buy a saw. Uh I wanna I wouldn't call that So you don't have to dry it, right? You can choose to leave it in the sale? Well, you yeah. can sell it from any of these areas. You know, so but it's to, only ever beneficial for you to move. Okay. But, but and to like your, you can have as many as you want in there. Yeah, yeah. yeah to your point, you can still only ever move over two mil, yeah. right? So you might have leftover so excess. I'm gonna pay a dollar. You guys. Yeah. Put her there, Joe. <laughs> yeah. You guys are amazing. So if I go there now and do that, oh. Oof. Oof. Then I would need still need three. Yeah. So, uh, screw you guys. <laughs> screw you guys. That's not very nice. Uh, let's go here. We're gonna pick up three woodcutters. I'll go here and pick up another raft. Three rafts. Raft well, strategy. Yeah. Well, maybe. Maybe. It's just kind of presented itself to me. It hasn't... Uh... Oh, I didn't put my guy back on. I will pay three dollars to get three woodcuts. All the planning. Oh, we actually, actually have uh, no, I'm Clay a... Ross from Capstone. Oh, That's hey, okay. Clay. <laughs> I'm actually only going to do two uh, of those guys. So now David sees that Joe only bought two woodcutters. So with his mill worker, he could potentially cut three. So there's at yeah. least one wood left. There's over at least there. one wood left over there for me. Well, it's funny because I was debating between these two, and we initially chose. Um, and I that's the problem is I'm like, well, I'm not going to get that food because someone else will choose it, but that keeps them from, from getting, getting the, the food, food. Yeah. as well. So I just thought everyone would go for all the wood, right? But I guess mm -hmm. we don't have the resources right now to get that many wood choppers. Yeah. So here's an interesting thing: is you've got fodder but no cart. You got both. There's only one cart left there to be picked up. So you're not gonna pick up a woodcutter? Well, I've got a guy. I've got a guy. He 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 can do, <laughs> he can do the work for me. Um, but no, I as awesome as that sounds, I will leave him. That's the the balance, right? Of how much do I mess you up? Yeah. Versus how much do I help myself? And how many? Oh, sorry, I got to choose uh, how many I need to get here. What do I need money for the rest of this round? Nothing. Ooh. Saws. Or tasks. You need tasks. Money for tasks. You need... Uh... I think I, I, I may have... Oh, no, yeah, because because uh, Dave picked up the giraffe. Okay, yeah. Um, but I always like just having wood in the pile because that gives you ability to do stuff. So I'll buy two of these guys. I might buy a third. Sorry, uh, Joel. No, that's okay. Um, I will... You guys messed up my whole turn by taking the carrot. Oh, Yeah. <laughs> I'll buy I'll buy a third, so I'll get a dollar back, and I'll get one more woodcutter here. Okay. Um, picking up the cart. Picking up the cart. I, mean, I have a feeling yeah. I'm gonna need it. Uh, I'm gonna go to a building and take the inn. Ooh, that seems like a turn too late, jo uh, Jeffrey. I <laughs> yeah. Maybe uh, I should have took that one first, and then. Yeah. Uh, hold, yeah, my turn here, so I can block Joe out of the buildings. So I'll choose to do that. Doesn't seem like a very nice thing to do at all. No, but this is this and game kind of. I know, I know, but uh, you know, I'm gonna see if a food strategy can somehow pay off. I'm not sure. So that's... the building that uh, so the building that I took allows me to put my token on the planning cards without having to pay any money. Uh, and the one that David took was he can actually sell money, uh, sell food at the market for uh, a dollar rather than just buying, being mm -hmm. able to buy it. So, oh my word. Woo! You guys, <laughs> see, this is where I like being on my own because now I can just kind of, let's pick up a food, yeah. some mushrooms in the forest along the way. <laughs> um. I'm going to choose to pick up a task. I'll take this guy. Nice. Hey, there's that saw that I needed. <laughs> uh, I'm going to pick up a task as well. Mm -hmm. I'll pay a buck. I'll take this guy. And let's put it up here. 
Oh, the camera's frozen. Oh. You got 780, yeah? Or 720. Sorry, guys, but the camera freezing. And we are back. There we go. Uh, whose turn is it? Is it my turn? I picked or, up a task. Yeah. So it's your so turn. my turn. Ooh, now you got your sledge. You're ready to go. We don't have any special trading cards out there. That joiner, though, I know you like your joiners. Uh, they're. They're pretty good. Yeah, they're pretty good. Especially and the earlier you get the them, earlier the better they are. So I will take the joiner. Oh man. Um, hold on. I might leave that for you, because he's just an extra food I need to spend. Yeah. Just leave him. Nah, I'll we'll use him. <laughs> and then it's over to. I'll take the food there. Okay. Well, I have food in my hand. <laughs> yeah. There you go. Thank you. And it goes in my food storage. Yeah. There you go. <laughs> and. I don't need thatch. I don't. I have a sled. I don't need another sled. So we'll just go ahead and jump over here to the to the summer. Okay. Now I I definitely want to slow the game down so I end up here after you guys. Right. So I'm just gonna start mopping stuff up. Joe, getting the free buck. Um, I'm going to actually, because the thatch does no good to me. Yeah. Right. Well, I, I should just sell it really. But the well, more the more you get, the more money you. And don't forget about this building. So you can actually exchange thatch for this wood, that is the true. shingle. During the hut construction. Yeah, during the hut construction. So oh, yeah, yeah. I'll, I'm just going to take a free coin then. I don't really think I need it, but I'd rather you guys not get it. There you and go. the cool thing is a lot of the stuff along the trail is essentially worth a, a buck. Like yeah. The coin, or a victory point, right? Coin, the food. So we'll go here. Um, we'll spend $2 to get two saws. Load up on them saws. Just in case I forget yeah. next round. Yeah, there you go. I'm going to go here, pick up a sire, um, which I won't be able to use unless I go buy a saw with the no money that I have. <laughs> but and I'm just delaying. <laughs> Joe goes there. I go here. And then I have no reason to stop or build. Other than a saw? Well, yeah. I, I, well, I guess I could come here and sell a food. For a coin. For a coin and then buy a saw. That's yeah. an option available to me. But you know what, though? I know next round I'm going to be going in and ripping through a whole bunch of stuff. So, so you don't want to saw them out? Actually, I do like that idea. At least I can cover it off so I don't have to worry about it later. Let's try that. So I'm going to sell this for a buck because of my building. Yeah. And I'll use that buck to buy a saw. And then you're done. Yeah, and then now I'm done. Okay. So we're going on to cutting. So Joe gets to cut first because it matters now because... They're both in the same area. Mm -hmm. I can only bring down two, but I can leave it in my storage anyway, right? Yep. So I use those guys to cut. You this, got one bear. this guy to move two down. Oh, shoot. I, oh. <laughs> <laughs> ah. <laughs> Where's my dollar? <laughs> Where's my dollar? Oh, what a waste. Take a loan. So I'm gonna, I'm that's not a bad idea. Three. <laughs> So the the two the two cutters that I purchased plus my guy yeah to get three to of that wood three of the wood yeah let's try the loan strategy yeah loan strategy okay so now your turn Jeff uh, I'll return three and just take these three okay so unfortunately um, I've got at least I got these three wood cutters and I do not have a dollar to change my location so this is where. Like I said, in order to get something done, yeah. it might be worth taking my, a loan. Whereas what I could have done is sold my food for the dollar and held on to it. Yeah. You know, but seeing that we're not doing uh, mulligans, uh, <laughs> I, I'm going to take a loan. So the loan comes over here, and he gives me what, four, four dollars? Bucks. Four bucks. So I'll, I'll take back three as I'll move my location. And I'm assuming you're, you're moving it over to here? Correct. And I've got these three wood cutters, which will give me one, two... Three, um, and let me just see if I want to use. Uh, oops, yeah, I'll just take those three. And the other thing I should mention is getting this food is only during the initial selection of the area. If you pay to move your guy, you, you do not you get the food. Get it, uh, so that was the cutting. Any wood arriving via raft? No. So then we move over to transport. Mm -hmm. uh, 
so I'm planning on doing double cutting next time. So I think we'll leave that there. So I will use my bear and my dude and my carrot. So my bear, carrot, and fodder allows me to move two. I'll just I'll chuck that over there. Yeah. Also doing the same idea. And I will put one here, one here. And then I'll just use my regular mill worker. He's just going to lug this straight over uh, to the cutting area. What can my joiner do again? He can't move anything, right? No. no, he's just basically giving you a buck. Giving me a little yeah. bit. And then he allows you at the end of the game to sell for an extra three, your milled wood. Um, so I used my three boats to put on my three there, and then I used my main guy just to haul this over his shoulder down to the sawing. So then we're on to sawing. Yeah. I have a saw! Woo! <laughs> so one saw, one saw. I will saw this uh, this piece of softwood to give me three milled pieces. I'm also doing the same. Yeah, as am I. Let me go to task phase. Uh, I'm cool. Um, I'm cool for tasks right now. Yeah, as am I. Um... Yeah, I'm cool for tasks. So then we go to selling. I'm going to sell one of these for two, and then this one for three, because I need that money so these uh, are four dollars. for the next round. So that gives me five bucks. Um, I will sell one of them as well for two dollars. Then we go to drying. So I will try two and dry two. Yep. And then we rinse and repeat. Okay. Uh, let's put all the workers back. Oh, sorry, yes. Uh, oh, yeah. And this. Do you want these ones? For me. Sure. Him. I need another kurt. I need two. So now reverse sword, right? right? Yeah. Another saw. And three. Flip over two new tasks, cards. So three here. Oh, we got some hardwood coming out. Yes. Yeah. And that's one thing that's really interesting about this game is the hardwood doesn't come out very often, so it's uh, and it's on all those task cards as you mentioned, so it becomes a pretty hot commodity when you see it. And that's uh, one of the other benefits of that winter being able to get any type of wood that you want on your wood pile. Usually, it's hardwood. Yeah. yeah. And those are the two, and space two is missing something, so we'll throw a firewood on there. All right. Let's. Uh... And. Joe, did you get an extra dollar for your joiner? And you get a dollar for your joiner. Okay. So this is our last chance to do the supply path before we have the feed and heat in winter. Mm -hmm. uh, so if you're missing food, like I am, uh, time to buy some. Yes. Which requires uh, money. Which requires money. <laughs> Which requires money. Oh, and what order did we... Yeah, it's I, already we, we did it. already did it? Yeah. So I'm starting player. I arrived there last. Hmm. What do I care about here? I want to stack up saws and a plank. Let's see. And this round, I'm actually going to trigger my cutting of, of that. So I think what I want to do. Oh, the camera froze again. Oh. Sorry guys, we had we did a live play the other day of Agra, and it was perfect the whole time. 1080, <laughs> not a hiccup. And then this time, maybe it's me. It yeah. might be you. You're just too too many pixels. Too many pixels. Yeah. <laughs> okay, All so right. you're you're getting ready to build yourself a little hut there. It looks like you got a wild card, a plank, and boy, wouldn't you like some wooden shingles to finish that hut? I would, actually. Hmm. I'm hoping that the place I've chosen, no one else is choosing to go there. 
Oh, sorry. I'm I'm one step ahead. Sorry, guys. Sorry, viewers. I'm one step ahead here. Um, I need to do that. I know where you're going, Jeffrey, and I want to go there too. <laughs> <laughs> but maybe I know that you know, that I know that you know where nope. I'm going, so I'm not going to go there. What? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> that doesn't make any sense. Okay, ready? Yeah. Okay. Six. Three. Oh, Joe. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Woo, David. Yeah, I know. So we each get a food, though. We can we can celebrate and that. And I wasn't in my food storage. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. And I get this food over here. Yeah. No one went for five. Oh, no. I, figured, I figured that would be the hot. Yeah, so did I. <laughs> I thought that would be the place where everyone would go. So I'm like, I'll go nab some food here. And then oh. I was like, oh, well, the other place is probably this one because of all the food. Yeah. I'll just go over here. Or even one looked appealing to me for the food. And then that way you don't have to focus. Oh, well. Okay, so sorry. Now I can focus on this. Mm. Can you buy and sell in the marketplace? Yeah. Oh, yeah. You can so long as you've got the ability. What did, what did, Someone said, it's the designer, publisher, and some random dude in the chat. I wish I had questions for you guys, but how to play this game well might be a bit uh, broad. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, well, if you want to learn how to play the game well, maybe you're watching the, the wrong podcast, the wrong live stream. <laughs> yeah. yeah, don't forget saws in the very first turn, I think is, uh, is a key one. Yes, definitely a key one. Well, and who's coming after me? You, Jeffrey? Yeah. Well, just for funsies, you guys are both starting to collect these shingles, so I'm going to take it. Dude, but there's three uh, this round. So. I know, there's a bunch out, but uh, that way maybe I might force you to accelerate past some other goodies. We'll see. Let's see. I'm, I'm going to be I'm gonna be taking some loans uh, this time, I think. So we're going to go over here. I'm going to want... I think I want two. Let's take two of these guys. One, two. So if I have a raft, that means I can just move one thing via the raft. Uh, or you could just have him carry it, and it rides right away. Yes. One raft yeah, does not, not really. Yeah, like, a, <laughs> like if you're going to start collecting rafts, you got to be thinking maybe delivering in like three three rounds from now or two or three rounds from now. Another layer of planning, yeah. well in advance. I don't know if I need this letter or not, but we're gonna take it. No harm, right? No harm. No harm. Um, yeah, it, the Clay said this game can be very cutthroat, especially if you aren't paying attention. Yeah. Like in one game that we played, uh, I wasn't paying attention, and David picked up all the hut construction materials. Yeah. And I just could not construct a hut that game. And huts are very powerful, giving you the ability to do some uh, stuff up here. And w one thing to consider is with these tiles coming out like once they're out of the game they're out of like the pool to resupply yep. like even when you spend them they're out of the pool so chances are these wooden shingles might not show up we again. might not see them again because the fact that you got three out right away so i know you like if you want a hut you need to pick up a wooden shingle this round yeah chances are um okay so i i'm guessing i'm gonna need to go and bear i might not need to i, I maybe i don't care about that i just think i'm gonna don't do it. Yeah. Don't do it. Yeah. Let's go get some chow. So for me, uh, fodder. Am I going to get a cart? The other thing is, like, I only have four bucks. Yeah. I'm currently uh, four food shy, so that's four dollars. So that's that. Anything I want to buy extra is gonna is gonna cost me. So buying that fodder. Let's not let's not worry about the fodder right now. But let's just. Pick up a card. Well, and that's good too because oh, there's another card out there, but it makes it more difficult for someone like me who might want to. And I got it for the next round. Yeah. So maybe then I'm I'm in the same space as somebody yeah. else, and I don't have to stop to pick up the card. Mm -hmm. David, is that a saw down there past the plan for? Yeah. Make your dreams come true. Well, I definitely need a saw this round because uh, we're gonna we're gonna let her rip. But I can always buy one. So I'm good. You know, I just took out a loan, so I feel like I should be reinvesting back into the you need, you need economy. To so I'm gonna just uh, we're just gonna have some fun here. We're gonna take some fodder and pay a dollar for that. 
So to me, let's plan some work here. Um, I think what I want, so if I go one, two, three, that would be summer. Yeah, let's do that for the uh, the one that you two guys are on. Okay. So one, two, three rounds from now, I get to do that. Okay. And you paid your two bucks. I paid nothing because I have the hint. Oh, yes, of course, yeah. Okay. The sauce. Mm -hmm. oh. Plan some work, David. Well, I'm thinking about it. Two would take me one into the spring. That seems like it. Well, and the dry, that's not a bad one for drawing because yeah. that at least gets you moving in time. You'll, you'll for get the end. three drawing yeah. steps. Yeah. That's not a bad choice, but you know me in drawing. I'm always horrible at it. <laughs> so why don't we force myself to, to actually get good at it? Let's force this upon myself. I'll pay a dollar. And I'll take my two, so it's going to be one. It's going to be in the spring of next year. Well, you don't have to pay a dollar because there's nobody on the card. Oh yeah, sorry. Um, but wait a second. That's really going to cause me to have some problems because I'm going to have to have a whole boatload of stuff here. You can do it. Yeah, let's do it. Let's just uh, let's just go for it. Two, two. I, I like this one, but I didn't see an opportunity to. I think with that one, like in a higher player count game, mm -hmm. more people. Soaking up those mm -hmm. to get their huts. Uh, so let's go here. I have four uh, wood there. Hey, man. Let's just get four of them. Mm -hmm. I take three. Hopefully that's the right decision. <laughs> well, I'm out, of, I'm out of money and I got to feed. <laughs> Yeah, I might have to take a loan out as well. I took out a loan, and it goes quick, guys. You know, yeah. my <laughs> woo, yeah, that was fun. That was fun. So hey, if every one of us has a loan, we're all on equal footing. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I will also go here. I will pay two two dollars because I need to pay a total of six. So four, six. Eesh, I will pay. Two dollars for two wood cutters. Well, it's back to me. Hey, oh, make money. Damn. <sighs> now it's me. Yeah, because we're we're gonna do a sale before we actually need to do the. F yeah. The. Yeah, so we'll do a sale and then we'll go into the winter phase. So we're yeah. good there. Yeah, so you can. Well, like after you sell, can you still go back and buy? No. No, no but, but at least you'll have money to to. Um, well, no, I guess you still need to pay for yeah, it, food. It's a. It's better to buy it here. Uh, yeah. I'll have to check the rules, but you, I think you have to pay three dollars for every food you're missing. Okay. So you want to have the food uh, ready to go. Uh, so Joe went. No, it's David. I go. Yeah. Okay. Well, I'm gonna definitely need this. Oh yeah, because I took the coin. I'll go here and I'll take this guy. Woo. Do I get it? I need to, right? Mm -hmm. Like we were just talking about. Yeah, we were just I... talking about it, and so now I have everything that I need for my huts. So anytime on any of my turns, I can turn them into huts and assign them. Mm -hmm. And uh, Alexander said, even after a lot of plays, I always had the feeling I could have optimized better. The games are rare when you have the feeling you did everything perfect. <laughs> okay, good, good. Uh, coming from you, that, that makes me feel a lot better about uh, my play. Because, you know, you always feel a little bit embarrassed by when someone sees you playing their game. Yeah. Like, no, that's not how it's supposed to be played. <laughs> how shameful. Well, the other thing that I like about this game, too, is I always feel like I'm not only competing against you guys, I'm competing against myself in previous plays. Mm -hmm. Because you can just always try to do better and get that little bit of extra, yeah. extra more money. It's my go, right? Yeah. I'll take one of these guys. Um, wait a second, do I want to do that? Yes, I will take one. Jeffrey? So I want to cut wood. So I'll take, I'll take him. Food? Food, yeah. Okay. I hate everything. <laughs> <laughs> so, oh. 
<laughs> Go buy one, Jack. I'm going to have to. Yeah. So I will jump to here. Uh, I have one dollar. I will buy a saw with that one dollar, and then for a loan. Okay, here you go. For and for four dollars that I just got from that loan, uh, I will buy for for food. Okay. Okay. That's me. For the two dollars I have, I'll buy two food. Okay. And then I will. Now a, a question: Can I do this at any point in time? Uh, that's yeah. just when you're making your hut. So the answer is yes, because you can make your hut at any point in time on your turn. But you already oh. have one of those tokens. Oh, oh, so it's just for building my hut. Yeah. yeah. Oh, okay, interesting. Did not realize that. So I will zip up here. I've got two food. Um, I'm going to need to pay six minus one is five, plus one is six total. So oh, I forgot about this guy. Oh. For what? I have to feed him. I, f I forgot that I had to feed him. Uh, did you want to take... Take another, uh, take a loan. Well, I would have sold this. Okay, so yeah, sell yeah, that. Yeah, let, let's yeah. do that then. Sell, sell that for two. Well, I'm going to sell two of them for two, two, bucks. two bucks, yeah. yeah. And then uh, pick up, take a net dollar back. Yeah, there you go. And here's your food. Okay. okay, so you're good there? Yeah. Okay, so here's $4 for four more food. One, two, three, four. And, ooh, I've got a dollar left to spare. That's burning a hole in my pocket. Um, <laughs> buy a saw. Just buy a saw. Fun. I might do, well if I do that. I, well, and saws are never they never go out of style. No, yeah, they, they don't. Never go out of style. They're... Someone asked, "How do I adapt to losing out on that saw?" We'll see. Yeah. No, <laughs> yeah. it, like yeah. what I like to do in the first round, anyways, is get some uh, firewood cut and just get it drying yeah. uh, throughout. But now that kind of through a wrench in that fight. And we should say, if like it maybe feels maybe to the viewer who's not as intimate with the group as maybe we are, and that we might be trying to making fun of Jeffrey along the way. But he, if anyone were to make a mistake like that and bounce back, it's going to be Jeffrey. So yeah. then that's it was a good thing to happen. Like I said, so. it's, it's like my handicap for the yeah. game. I gotta go here. Yes, I wanted you to go and get in front of me. <laughs> So then I'll tuck in behind you. Because you want it to move over. Correct. Yeah, yeah that's... so did I. Oh, shoot. Um, can I not buy that saw then? <laughs> <laughs> hey, man, you can yeah. take another loan. No, no. I. This, Mister, mm. this is my sixth play. Yeah. So, so no, I didn't want that doll. I wanted that dollar. Uh, anyway. I don't have the option to move because there's wood to cut, right? Uh, I will see if you can optionally. Because I've never... Because I got a dollar. Yeah. <laughs> well, you know, it's funny. I, I was saving that dollar specifically for that, but then you're like, well, why don't you get another saw? Yeah, good idea. <laughs> In fairness, I went back and yeah. sold this to get my wood, so if you yeah. wanted to take that yeah, back, I'd you, be okay with that. To, if you want to do that. But, well, this is a friendly game. But yeah. I may be able to move anyway. Yeah. Right? So, like, uh, that's what you... I'll, I'll, live, I'll live with my, my lack of planning. No, it's, if you're the first person there, you have to cut wood in that area. Okay. It's only subsequent people. Well, well then, would, would you be okay if I un sure. undid that? Okay. So, I'm giving you guys benefits and handicapping myself. Yeah. Well, and it might be a close game. It might, <laughs> it might be a close game. That kind of messes me up, though, because I, I, too, wanted to move. Um, well, no, because I was deliberately going slow. Because yeah. I didn't want, I'm like, well, I'll uh, go slow so you get there first. All right, so let's go into cutting. Okay. So I've got the three cutters, may as well cut the three pieces of wood. Someone said uh, I would make fun of him too. <laughs> <laughs> of me? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> That's fair. Um, my turn to cut? Yeah. I'll pay a dollar. I'll go here and I'll cut these two. That's pretty good. Yeah, that's huge. Well, especially for a mulligan move, I feel I almost feel bad about it. Right. <laughs> oh, don't worry, we're asterisks in this yeah. one. Yeah. Yeah. Big asterisk. Uh, mm -hmm. Then I will spend my four guys and get these four pieces of wood. Okay, log driving. Mm -hmm. Hey, woo! Got I got some wood arriving. Yeah, I got some wood arriving, and I when I saw firewood, I'm gonna get oh, six wood. Frozen again. Oh. Buy a new computer. Yeah, I need to buy a new computer. Well, this is like this computer's like five years old. <laughs> oh, really? Okay, so I'm going to saw one. Thank goodness it's not like a dexterity game where yeah. like mid-shot yeah. the camera freezes. I need, oh yeah, so I can do that. 
Uh, so let me go on to transport. I have these two guys, and we're going to use them to just carry over some some wood. Yeah, I have the two guys. We're just going to do some lugging. I'm going to do that right to my saw area. And I actually planned to ha I have everything I need. Very nice. So now so we're I'm, sawing? So I've only got one person to saw, so I'm going to put them here. Yeah, so you can sell them? So I can sell them. So we go sawing. I'm gonna use my mill worker and my saw and two saw. Oh, two saws, yeah. And because I planned the work, I now get to cut four mm -hmm. uh, this round. So each guy gets to cut two. So that's going to be a total of uh, four for each of these. So that's twelve. One, two, three, four, five. And I got to cut my um, firewood for six because I planned I need the work. One more. Oh my goodness. So I'll put three up here, and I'll put the rest in my selling area. I think I'm going to throw four up there. Well, this guy, yeah. Uh, I don't want to do that for And I will no. use, I'll cut this guy into three. I'm, I'm feeling pretty happy now with how much uh, how much resources I have here. Yes. Oh yeah, that, woo, look at your sale area. Uh -huh. Very nice, Jeffrey. Okay. Then we go to uh, task phase. I'm just gonna go ahead and assign this piece here so I get it out of the way. I'm yeah. gonna assign my plus And you can one. assign as many as you want at this yeah. time. Yeah, I'll go here, I'll go here. And then we go into the cell portion. Um, looking at what's Six. coming up. Six, seven for me. I think I'm gonna sell. All of well, actually, I'm going to keep this plus one there. So that's two, four, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve bucks. Woo! To reinvest. I'm going to do seven here. Look at that. Okay, then we go drawing. Okay. Move over. We go into winter time. Okay. So beginning of winter, you get a piece of wood of your choice into your wood pile. I will take a hardwood. Hardwood for me as well. I will take a hardwood as well. Now, this is where you can use your uh, workers to cut wood. So you get two pieces of firewood to your wood pile. It doesn't come from out here. Uh, you can transport or you can saw. I have no saws. I have a sled, but... And how much can they transport? Just one? So, uh, two. Two. So, one guy, a sled, can transport two pieces of wood. You can increase the amount you can transport by spending food. Up to an addition, three more. Um, okay, so I'm just Essentially, gonna, you're paying for more dog food for extra so dogs. So, I'm going to use this guy and the sled Yeah. to, to go move to. this down to here. I'm going to use him. I'm going to get two more uh, firewoods over there. Okay, uh, tasks in the winter is only in the second year. Food, we need six. There's my six. Yeah, I, I need, need, I need uh, seven. I need six minus one plus one, so six total. There's my six. And the firewood. Oh. And then the heating, only need three. Pretty uh, mild winter. A mild winter, indeed. So then we go back, we're into the second year, we just do it all over again. Trying again. Oh wait, oh so, oh I messed that up. What? Because I put this as my two, so I should have cut there. Oh, so when you cut your, did you cut any firewood? No, I didn't cut any firewood. Oh, uh, yeah. Messed that one up. Okay. You want to swap it for your no, three? No, I, because I, I, since I, I had none down here to cut anyway, and, oh. I don't, and I only had my one guy, so. Oh, okay. Yeah, I should have put my three there for spring. No, but that's what I'm saying, is you want to pretend that no, was a three? No. Nope. Um, I made the mistake. Live, live with it, right? Yeah. You guys are making me feel so bad. <laughs> almost, almost. <laughs> uh, all right, so let's just uh, set up for the next season. Here. Okay. Let's, uh... 
Yeah, the first time through, I guess, you got to really pay attention to when you're triggering those things. Yeah. Well, it's funny because I find I've been doing a lot more where I want to come in second and pay to go somewhere else after you see it. And then yeah. you're saving that dollar and then you get distracted by something shiny. Like, whoa, squirrel. And you run over there and then you get there. Uh, I messed up. Yeah, I messed up. I'm pretty happy to have uh, 12 bucks going into this round. Yeah, and then nice. you guys each get a dollar for your joiners. Yeah. That's really all they're good for is a dollar, right? Yep. And, and you can put a piece of plus one wood up here, and you can sell it at the end of the game for plus three. Oh, okay. Good to know. So when you're assigning your, your tasks. I probably would have done that instead of moving that one up to there. Okay. And what doesn't have anything? Just space three. So the turn order here is going to be blue first, orange, and then red. Mm -hmm. And we got the fawn, we got the joiner. These are done. Okay. And so then, just a heads up for this year in the winter, it's going to be seven food or mm -hmm. eight for you, yeah. plus seven wood. So more, more firewood this time. Yeesh. So I have a lot of wood here. But. You never have too much. Right? Mm hmm Right, Davis? Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> oh, man. Let's go. Let's go there. Oh, I might regret this decision, but we'll see. I know where you're going, Jeffrey. I'm coming. I'm coming to hang out with you. Are Don't you do it. Are you ready? <laughs> oh, Joe! <laughs> Every time, dude. Yeah. Well, we each get a food. Yeah. So let's I have a look. I love it. Stuff. Yeah. Man, this is awesome. It usually it's you and me always go to the same spot. And, ah. Oh, this is great. Oh, man. Hey, oh, man. I'm first. Yeah. Get that saw. Hey, you know, the saw. saws was causing all the problems in this game. You know, like yeah. even wanting to buy one. Uh, so my goal. Mm -hmm. I got this fodder. It's not doing anything if I don't have proper equipment. That's you know? true. I got an ox just walking around the field waiting to be put to work. There you go. And then uh, back to me. So I got a, a metric ton of uh, wood over here. I'm going to be cutting three more. So that's going to be eight wood all over here. Mm -hmm. Now, I probably want... Let's go here. Let's spend five bucks for five of these guys. There we go. Um. Mm. Oh my god. <laughs> oh. <laughs> David, what are you doing? Just uh, you know, just having a little fun. Just bastard. <laughs> <laughs> and there it is, the first swear of the of the cast. <laughs> We've done really good up to this point in time keeping our <laughs> Oh, you needed that plank, Joe. Oh, oh sorry. Bummer. What? Shucks. Uh, Shucks. That's... Do I get another cart? <laughs> That's the. <laughs> you got a cart. You got a cart. Oh, I do. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Just stop being angry at everybody. Stop being. A, 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 I'll your turn. My turn. Uh, let's go chop some stuff here. Um, or wait a second. At least you don't have a loan. That is true. Yeah. I don't think it's going to matter, you know, but we'll see what happens at the end of the game. Oh, where'd you get that uh, food? From oh, Jamie and I got one here. Oh, right, right, yeah. right. What, you think I'm cheating? Yeah. <laughs> wow. The trust is just gone, Jeff. I am going to, uh, you know what? Screw it. I think I'm just going to zip on ahead and get this dollar. You're not chopping any wood. Oh, uh, no. Dude. Well, that way you don't, you can't move. <laughs> what? No, he uh, still. Uh, I believe he still gets the choice. Oh, okay. Yeah. Well, I can, just, I, I can still chop. I, I can still chop a piece. A piece, right? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, 
I'll go here. I'll pay a dollar. David. Good. So. How would I mess that up? I don't want to mess this one up again. Alexander said, "If everyone knows the game well, it's a planning mistake. Yeah. But if someone plays for the first time, we would re rearrange everything like you just bought the game, if it's possible to rearrange." Mm. So, so Mulligan for the the new people. Yes. Right, yeah. Thank you, Alex. Uh, so, so drawing <laughs> drawing double capacities. So that is in that phase. Yeah. Uh, so I can move four. Yeah. So from your sale area, starting off into your drawing area, you can transfer four over. Okay. I don't think I have to save any of that. I might not do a whole lot of planned work this time. That probably will come back to bite me. But oh, I get one hardwood. Uh, oh, yeah, that's what this orange. one is. Did you take the no. hardwood when you went there? Who? Who's orange? Yeah, it was me. Did you take your hardwood? For the uh, overtime? No, I took the I took the, the this one. one there. Yeah, but you had one no, for your. No, I didn't take that one. No. So go. I'm gonna go down to planned work. Sounds like pay a dollar. Yeah, because I only did take the one here. And yeah, I didn't. Uh, so then back to me. Do I want to plan some work? I mean, I think it would be great. Because let's go here. I'll put my one out. Now, you can go to the same card multiple times. Nice. And I don't have to pay because I have the, the in. Very yeah. nice. I did, I Look at David just ripping through. Yeah. Um, I would love to buy two task cards. I know I, I wanted to um, pick up a task, but I also have other things ahead of me that I kind of wanted to make. I wanted to keep ahead of you guys on this path. So I think I'm going to buy two. David can only cut at most one. Uh, unless I buy a saw. No, I mean wood cut. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry. Yeah. Like, oh, is it frozen again? again? Is it frozen? Again? Go ahead, Jeffrey. Uh, let's go here. Let's uh, spend three bucks for three of these guys. Yeah. Um, Michael? Yeah. I'll go here. I'll take him and I'll pay a buck for him. Interesting. I'm going to go to task cards. Okay, it makes. Uh, Makes my choice a little bit better. I'll go here. I will also pay a buck, and I will take uh, this one. Yeah, I, I want. There's a couple there that I thought I might be able to achieve, but we'll go here and get a boot. All right, nice. Let's take this. Yeah, uh, mop it up. Mop it up. Go here. Get the other food. Come back, to Joe. I'm going to go before David. <laughs> Unless you go to the marketplace. Yeah, but then he can go here. And then... <laughs> hey! Hey! hey. <laughs> oh, man. That really messes up my plans. Real hard. Mm. <laughs> yeah, Alexander said, in case of me, there was really no way to rearrange my saw. Right. But... That that's my my gift to you guys. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well, I guess I will <sighs> go here and buy a saw. Like David, uh, David was ripping through here. Yeah. He's still gonna end up there after. Yeah, well, I'll go here. Well, I'll go first. Oh, sorry. Yes. Yeah. You. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna get the joiner. Yeah. There you are. Okay. Go ahead, David. Uh, I will go <coughs> here. Yeah, because you're gonna go there, and I'll still. Get oh yeah, he'll, he'll still get in there first. Unless, of course, I go here. Of course, yeah. Yeah, but the thing is, is you that, need a saw. Well, I really, yeah, want, yeah, I really want. I really want to exploit saw. this bonus here. I've got a saw, but the the thing is, is I would like to saw multiple things so I can get. Drying because I got double drying here. But, but, I mean, this this one will give you the four that you need. 
True. Well, but the thing is, you saw this one. I want to saw it. Like, I have I have jo- objects here that need to be... That need to be saw. Really? It's not saw. the end of the world because I'm going to get a hardwood yeah. at the start of the next round so, anyway. So, so. I'm going to not worry about you. I'll just... Uh, yeah. <laughs> I'm just going to focus you on my... You my girlfriend own. did a lot in comedy. <laughs> <laughs> so, I'll, I'll buy a an additional saw uh, this round. There we go. I will take this guy. Never know when you might need it, right? Yeah. Oh, wait a second. We we skipped out of order there somehow because you just. Oh yeah. Oh should, yeah. Should be. It should have been me first. You you should have gone. Then you yeah, should then have gone. Yeah. Now it's now, David's turn. Here I go. Okay. And now it's my turn. Yeah. So then I go yeah. behind David. There you go. Uh, don't need food. I have two bucks. Um. Do I buy a saw? Some saws. I might as well. All right. Mm-hmm. Then I then I'm set. Yeah, let's just buy two saws. Oh, no, oh, not yeah. connected. You, you, I'll, I'll chat. fix the chat in a second. Uh, then I come here, and then you guys can start off with your cutting. Okay, so I will use this guy to take him, and then I think that will be it. Okay, um, so I'm going to obviously pay a dollar. Uh, to move over to here, and then oh, actually, sorry, I'm not going to cut. Sorry. Okay, I'll yeah. still pay the dollar yeah. to move and cut with my two guys. One of these and one of these. The designer is defending me that I was teaching, so it's yep. easy to miss. Oh yeah, oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I'm gonna use my three wood cutters. We'll take. But the designer doesn't know. Even when you do teach us. You still win. Right. <laughs> yeah. I don't pull punches. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, so cutting, anything mm. arriving via the river? Nope. Nope. Transport. Look at all these guys. Woo. Wow. Well, I'm going to use, I'm going to be a little more efficient. I'm going to use my cart and some fodder to transport three. Uh, As am I. Well, I'm going to be efficient too. I'm going to use my cart, my fodder, and a dude. So that's three coming down. So we'll go ahead and put that here I think the next turn I'm doing that then I still have five five guys so let's use those five to just just carry it all mm-hmm. carry it all down I think I need to do that and I'm likely going to do a couple hmm so let's put three there. That'll give me nine. Let's put four there and another one there. And see if we can't make some magic. Uh, yeah, because you're going to get the du- double cutting next time. Half double. And this guy is used for transport. Okay. Um, so then we go to sawing. Okay. I'll so use my saw and my one of my saws. Oh, this make three. I'll cut this hardwood. I'm going to use my two saws and my saw and my guy to cut uh, the two hardwoods that I have. Can I have two hardwood sticks, please? This. Four. No, the camera's frozen again. Okay. So next on the purchasing list is not another game. Uh, new computer. New computer. Yeah. yeah. It's really bad today. Yeah. Uh, so task. Okay, so I'm going to. Well, sorry, Jeffy. I'm moving this stuff behind here. you here. I will assign this one up here. Oh yeah, I guess I will assign this one up here too. Might as well. I don't know how to do that now. Oh shoot, this is a plus two. I will not assign that up there. I will be drawing that one. Because I need that to get up there. Mm-hmm. Yeah. By the end of the game. Uh, so I'm not signing anything. So then selling. I'll sell this for three. I'm going to sell these two for six. I'm selling four. Just unmilled for 12 bucks. This for yeah. three would be six bucks. Yes, please. Oh, bless you. Oh, excuse me. So I'm going to sell these for six bucks. And then drawing. 
So I gotta use, I gotta push four across. All right, on to summer. So now I get the hardwood at the start of the phase? Uh, or at the end? I think you can take it any time. Okay. I guess it doesn't yeah. matter. It doesn't matter. Yeah. Uh, so, you take this, take this back. So we're gonna have how many more drawing phases? Uh, two more. And keep in mind, if you buy, if you build a hut, if you have the opportunity to do so, you can also use uh, one of your tokens to uh, do a draw there as well. Oh yeah. Um, like if if you're in, if you get the hut built. Uh, no, I should get this. Sorry, David. Oh no, no problem. All right, let's. And four is without, so he gets a firewood. And this one is a wild. Okay. Yeah, so that you can still get there. So the order here is not going to be, uh, oh, sorry, blue. Oh, you've already done it? Blue, no, no. red, there we go. Yeah. All right, let's see. Where are we going to go? Oof, where are you going, Joe? I don't know, man. Where do you want to go hang? Let's go hang out in the forest here together. <laughs> oh, and an extra dollar for your... your yes, for your... Uh, for my troubles. Yeah, for, your for your joiners. joiners. If you... I always forget about the joiner, like, unless you remind me or someone else does. I. There's some... Uh... Ooh, there's some juice out there. That's five, and that's one. Huh. And you build huts during the task phase? At any time that any you time? need it, pretty much. But once you build them, you need to assign all three. Assign all three? Yeah, so you, you take the three tokens, you flip them over, you got three tokens to assign up there as you want. Oh, okay. So you can get like three extra mill workers. All right, we're going to test it. Nice. Woo! Wow. Yeah. <laughs> I love it. Oh, that feels good. It feels good. And then you get those two um, woods there, too. Guys, way to go. Way nice. to go. Like, that, uh, that's called fair play right now. <laughs> yeah. uh, and I'm first. Mm -hmm. I have all these rafts. Do I need another raft? I don't think so. We're going to go up here. Let's take a food. Just kind of yeah, yeah, mop up that plank. <laughs> <laughs> Getting that as quick as I could. Yeah, yeah, so now fast. I can build one, right? Yep, correct. Ooh, so do I, is there a rafting strategy here to be had? Um, cool thing about rafts is that they, um, uh, at the end of the game, if you have anything on there, you get to count them as well. Mm. Yes. But, so during the final sale, uh, if you have something on the raft, you can sell one type of wood that you have waiting on the river. Um, so it's still worth picking up rafts later on in the game. Oh, and we needed two fodder out here during the oh, sorry. as well. And a joiner. There we go. Hmm. Let's just pick up a slate. Dude, like you oh. never buy bears. Yeah, you know, they're needy. I think I think they're union unionized. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. They, so it's back they, to me? They're needy. Well, I like bears. Mm -hmm. Um I'm gonna need Cutting five this turn. So I'm going to need one for that. Now I need three. So I'll just buy four. Oh, you got the wagon. Nice. One, two, three, four. I go. I will. I'll pay for my two wood cutters. That's over me. Yeah. Uh, let's just get. Oh, uh, actually, I kind of want that. So we're gonna go here instead. We're gonna buy five. See, I'm. I noticed this in a lot of the in a lot of the plays that me and David have. 
is that I'm usually a big time employer. Yeah. Whereas you use a very lean workforce. I do, but I typically lose. So maybe <laughs> maybe I could uh, uh, beef it up a little bit. Yeah. Um, I just don't like dealing with all the needs of a of a big workforce. Right. I'm kind of a. I like to go out there with my axe in the solitude of the forest, and just enjoy it. Okay. Back to me. You know what? A dollar would be nice, but let's go here. We'll spend a dollar, and I'm gonna take. Oh, <laughs> nice one. Congrats. Nice task here. Just put my money. Is that a hardwood plus two there? Yeah. yeah. Tell. So now it's okay. my turn. Yeah. yeah. Uh, so I'm gonna go to the task, spend a dollar, taking back four, taking this one. Well, that sort of uh, solves my problem. Um, well, there's this one for two hardwood. <laughs> Look at all the hardwood you have. I know, but one, two, and another card that might would be three, right? So three, four. You got three. Yeah. You get another one over there. You can do this. I appreciate your enthusiasm and confidence in me. Um, I do not share it. Maybe it's time to you can build. You guys can both build huts. See, I'm in trouble because I gotta get I gotta get a lot of drawing done. <laughs> So I gotta get yeah. this down and cut and then dry. Well, building your hut will help here. with that because you can use a guy to dry. Well, what's your other one? A plus one? Yeah. So you have a plus one and a plus two? Yeah. So let him go to, to plus two. two yeah. Because like, there's there's still three more drawing phases, right? Mm -hmm. uh, two more. Two so, more. So he'll get the plus two. He'll get the plus two. And the other guy will get the plus one. Yeah. And then I can complete a task in, and at the, in the winter in the second year. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, so I don't need to rush to complete these two tasks. I know they're going to no. be completed yeah. just and by then, letting it all happen. And then also don't forget about your joiner, because if you can get something up there, he's plus three for the cell yeah. as well for the milt. Oosh, what, what do I do here? Well, let's just... And I can't put a plus two up there. i got to put a plus one. Uh, it can be as long as it's at least Minimum. plus one. Oh, okay, so I, yeah, I can move that one up there. But if I go here, I can at least get two bucks for it. Dude, we'll, we'll, I know. I you know. left a buck behind? So I could get $2 up front, plus it's a. Because uh, that will allow me to at least sell this thatch. So it's back it. to me, eh? Yeah. yeah. Uh, let's go here. Let's spend a buck for the extra guy. Mm -hmm. Look at this workforce. It's just, it's impressive. Oh, you got a food over there? Oh, pass me the token. Um, I go. I will. Now it's back over to me. We're gonna go. Oh, oh. That was a Rado. Oh, oh. oh. <laughs> Let's go here and we'll take uh, take that saw. Oh man, I got such a big uh, cutting turn and we yeah. are frozen again. Yeah, he a huge cutting turn. Uh, so that's my turn. Yep. I feel like you're going to win. <laughs> <laughs> uh, did you go, uh, Joe? Yes. So my turn here. You know what? This spotter doesn't do me any good if I don't have a wagon. So. Uh, I go next. Oh, sorry. Then you go. Hmm. Then David. Hmm. Go here. Look at all that money you have that you're not uh, reinvesting. This uh, is a crying shame. Uh, well, so I can definitely saw those woodcut um, saw. I guess the one thing I found the first time that I played this, I wasn't paying sawing attention. Them. Yeah, I wasn't sawing. And so when it came to the end of the round where I wanted to do everything, I just didn't have the saws. I didn't have the ability to actually do it. So you got to actually keep up on it. Yeah. So we will do that. So it's my turn? Yeah. So when do I need to form a hut? Whenever you want. Whenever, whenever, whenever okay. you would so use one of its come abilities. Here and I'm gonna buy two saws. You got some saws over there. And then it's just between Joe and I and now. Then I'm gonna form a hut. Okay. I don't need to do any drawing because it'll get there by itself. Yeah. The mill workers. I I really like using them for the mill workers because they're yeah. very powerful. Well, it's, yeah, especially like here. Yeah. Okay. So you're putting them all on the mill workers? Yeah. Oh, very nice. So my go? Yep. I will 
Go to the finish. All right. So cutting time. Well, there's no competition this time. Nope. All right. Five dudes. Okay. Then anything arriving via the rafts? No. Nope. No. Nope. Transport. So my one bearer, my fodder, fodder and uh, my cart is going to transport two things. So let's go. We'll take these two. Let's put one there, one there, and then these three guys are just going to lug it. Throw it over their shoulders. I'm transporting nothing. Okay. Transporting <laughs> 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 nothing. <laughs> Sawing. I'm using both my guys to saw. Okay, this is this is the big turn. Okay. This is what I've been planning for since three turns ago. So I have my plan work on my saws, and saws can cut two apiece. And well, number three is each of my firewoods give me six mm -hmm. uh, things. Mm -hmm. So yeah, hardwood. So three saws, two saws plus my mill worker. That's going to cut all six of this. So let's do this guy. That gives me uh, three of these. We'll put those down here. And then that's, uh, each one of these is six. So that's 30. Is that math right? Five times six. Oof. Oof. I think I think Jeffrey knows how to do the math. Is it guys, cause is, this, uh, is this 30 points I just got? Um, so. He's yeah. up to a substantial lead now. Yeah, yeah. So I'm going to need to use Actually, multipliers. No, I'm not going to. So uh, I'm going to get my firewood up here. So that's uh, a five times. Yeah, we'll do that. Six, seven, that leaves 23 left over. And I will just uh, sell the 23 of it. I'll just take the money. Okay. Just so it, uh, I don't need to count out all of that. Are we in? Now we're on to the task phase. Okay. So oh, it's I'll frozen again. Put that guy there. In there. Sign him up here. No, I'm not going to sign him up there because I'm going to need one of those guys to get to there. Task phase, I'll sign one guy over here to the joiner. I'll sign that there. I'll sign that there. And I'll sign that uh, there. Okay. So now the crappy thing, though, is I need some more hardwood. Otherwise, I'm not going to be able to complete these. And then in addition for my selling, uh, I'll sell these two for four a piece. So that's another eight this bucks. For three bucks. I'm selling nothing. <laughs> <laughs> I'll sell that for three bucks, and then I'll sell these two for four dollars. Why don't you go drawing? Uh, drawing's done for everyone. So we are in the last phase here. No, so no. Uh, I'm red. last. Yep. Okay. Two there. That 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 and these last. And six is without, so he gets a firewood. Oh, and then the tasks are... Oh, yes. Sorry. And we're full up on fodder and everything. All right. Here we go. Mm-hmm. So just a reminder, we need seven firewood and seven food, uh, plus anything for your joiners.
Oh, sorry, guys. Um, Jeffy had a lot of money already. What? Huh? Mm. Okay. Two. Three. Ah! (laughs) I thought for sure that three would be uh, heavily contested, so... Yes. <laughs> You've been benefiting from Joe and I's uh, yeah. uh, synergy here. So uh, Joe was the first to go. Mm-hmm. Then David. Oops, this guy's in the back. I feel pretty good about this game. I I think mm-hmm. you know that missing that saw in the beginning set me back a little bit mm-hmm. but I feel like I've done well to recover mm-hmm. making 30 mil pieces of firewood yeah yeah that's one thing that I haven't done well is use, use and, the and cards my first game too I kind of ignored a lot of those planning cards because you kind of need to see it play out yeah a couple times and try and because it's all about timing mm-hmm. so do you guys want to do something like super fun like really just, fun just jump to there <laughs> kind of dude here. no way yeah way no we'll, way we'll pay a dollar and I'll take the middle one how are you going to get all this wood out with your huts well uh, yeah well, I, hold oh. on here so before I do anything really dumb I don't need it because I'm going to get this um, like I, I can saw this up I've got everything at one two three four I've got one two three like I'll get this I'll have a plus two here like I don't care, like I. But it's I, money just sitting it. there. Yeah, it's just sitting there. But the, this is twenty six points versus the other one that's eighteen. So I could go and do some other stuff, right? But I don't want you to take this one. I'm not, I'm not going to. Oh okay. Because well. if you look too, see, I have uh, one piece of hardwood. Mm-hmm. I'm gonna get another one plus another one. I have my three. I'm not gonna take another card. Right. And he has, his. He's getting maybe one more piece, but he doesn't have the. The stuff there. To well, I made my decision. <laughs> <laughs> but I think it's good for people to see. You know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. We'll, we'll see. Like I jumped over. I maybe could have picked up this, a free saw on my way. That yeah. would have been fun. Uh, I'll take the food. I don't even know anymore. Um... I need to move some stuff down here. I think David mm-hmm. is good for people to see different right. different styles of play. Well, well, the other thing too is you got to remember I still got a cart in this. I can still love and you, what I and have. And you got this, which can get you some more yeah. mill workers. Yeah. So I'm gonna buy two of these guys. Like honestly, I was paranoid because like, well, that's a good one that I actually have stuff for. I'll buy two of those guys. Okay, David. Um. Here. I'll take this guy and I'll pay a buck. A buck to take the second guy. So I think I'm not gonna be doing a whole lot of a lot of wood cutting here. I think I'm just gonna take two guys. Okay. Oh, yeah, play. How are you transporting? Yeah, if you're not doing a bunch, yeah, you probably just end up lugging them. Well, do I mop up a few things that you can't get? Because <laughs> where are you, whose turn is after me? It's uh, Jeffrey's. Jeffrey's. Well, you don't have any fodder. You'd have to stop there first, so Joe will definitely get his cart. So. Let's just go here. Um, so I will buy a two saws. And remember, this is your last opportunity to buy saws. Yeah, so I actually may have to buy three. So here. You're going to use two right away. Plus, if you yeah. want to saw in the last, in the winter, you need to buy them now. Yep. Jeff's got so but, much money. But I can still sell the softwood for it. Yeah, so you know what? I'm just going to buy two saws. So I don't think I do want to saw in the winter. Oh, sorry, what did I do? I put two there and I got two of these. Sorry. 
And for food, two, four, six, we need seven. So there's a buck for another. Yeah, because you have to pay one extra for your joiner, but yeah. your uh, store, store run is one less. Oh, no. Boy, did I screw the pooch in that one. I think I need another. Yeah, I'll get another saw then, so I have my firewood. Good tip. Yeah. Yeah. So because I'll saw this, I'll saw one of these. So. And you then, still have money. You're yeah, still, I still have still money. Here. Okay, we're good. So I'll buy another saw. Um. Okay. Now, now I think that's. I think for me, all I need to do next is jump down to here, uh, spend four bucks. So oh. when I move. Do I move to a place where there's no one else? Or can I move to your place and saw your... It has to be a place where no one else okay. is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. You can't, like, jump in and... Steal your stuff. Steal someone else's yeah. stuff. Oh. Pay a dollar. Get a fodder. Shoot. Oh, did you... I, I forgot to sell. Oh, just go ahead. Do you mind if I sell those yeah, two? Yeah, go ahead. Okay. Two bucks? Yeah, for two bucks. Okay. Uh, David? One dollar? Yeah. Jeffrey? Uh, let's go here and get a saw. Then back to David. Can't build a building. I don't want another task fair because I can't complete it. Um, I don't need that. Don't want a joiner. And don't need a raft. So we'll just jump over here and take the saw. And back to me. I don't need a carriage on the ramps. We're going to go up here. I have seven food. I need one more. So one dollar for one food. I'm going to saw some stuff. So that's coming there. I need at least one more saw. So we're going to do that. So... Man, yeah, I don't know what I've done here. Yeah, I screwed up. And so I'm gonna use one guy to sled it. And I, so I'll spend another dollar for one more food. And I think, okay. do this. I think that's it. I know what I'm gonna use these for. I'm gonna make those mill workers. So we are good to go. Back to you, Joe. So I can use frozen can do the bushel oh. to do this, right? Yep. So I can make another set of huts then. Uh, you only make one set of huts oh. for the whole game. No, oh, okay. Yeah, I'm just working through my hut right now. Shoot. Thought I could make two. But you can still, if you can get like a set sell it for some money like you have a have two of those yeah so you can sell that for two bucks yeah and no point to pick up anything else yeah um, take my guy oh sorry yeah, I'm uh, sure. yeah. there um, so I need to use the fodder to get the cart right or like I need to use the mm -hmm. Use fodder to use a cart. Like I can't just use a cart to move something down, right? right. So you only. Okay. So I'll sell these two for two bucks. Yep. I need to buy two foods. I'll just leave that in there and take my two food. Yep. And then I need some saws. I only take two of them. I'm gonna move all four down. I got one, two. This last winter is when the gears really start. Yeah, yeah. Well, it's really good. Like, I like how you were able to show earlier how you were able to get synergistic planning with all your materials. And then, boof, it was like a huge turn. Yeah. And I th I'm glad, like, because that's usually you do that once or twice a game where you're able to get this with your materials and to really maximize the yeah. efficiency of it. Okay, so I'm going to spend four bucks and get four saws. Oh no, th three bucks and get three saws. Three saws. Maximum at four. Yeah. Oh, I should have bought this task card. Pass me a saw. No, um, I have two here. There you go. Yeah, I, I should have got the task card because I could have completed this task with mm -hmm. all my saws. With all, yeah. But 
right, and then that's it. Yeah. Is there? All right. So cutting. Cutting. Doesn't matter. We're all in different. Oh, you guys aren't. So I'll just go ahead and cut mine. Um, I'm not cutting anything. No. Nope. Interesting. All right. Well, I'll cut two. Well, I need my my dude. Should have bought some more salt. Okay. Messed up. Big time. <laughs> uh, saws are the, are the death of me. Nothing arriving by river. Transport. One guy oh, is going yes. to lug this down to here. And then this guy and three rafts are going to put these three right here. One guy and the fodder will take down three. Oh, yeah, because those three will be able to sell for, what, three each yeah. at the end? Yeah, very nice. And then sawing, and then one guy's just gonna lug one down. And the cool thing about that, it keeps rafts relevant even to the final round. Yeah. Yeah. Um, so I get any piece. Oh, but I can't move the wood down anyway. So. Okay. So sawing. Yeah. So I'll saw this into four. Saw this into a piece. Of so there's no difference whether I saw now or if I saw in the last round, right? Unless for the. Well, heating. you want to saw. Mm -hmm. Yeah, well, you get the saw before the heating, but your gray guy is going to be gone. So you want yeah. to use, yeah. and you can use your mill worker essentially twice. You can use them now, and then you can use them again. Yeah. So I will saw oh, one yeah, good. for this one. For four. For four. Moving them up oh, here. Yeah, I should have should have got another saw. I think. The mill work. Oh, yeah, see, I, oh, no, I was tapped out for saws. So the mill worker. Oh, no, but oh. I can keep... You won't be able to buy any more saws. Well, no then more. Still yeah, there. so I'll, I'll use a mill worker and a saw to chop this up. And I'll put three up here. And one down, and there. One down there. Okay, then uh, task time. Oh, okay. What I actually, because I'm going to be able to move a guy down with the worker, so that and then I'll have these two guys to chop. So when I move the three down, I'm actually going to put two here initially. Okay. Yeah. Um... So task time, I'll put that guy there. I'll put that guy there. I'm gonna wait and assign my task afterwards. All right, for the next drawing round. Selling? I'm selling nothing. Uh, neither one. Because we'll sell it all at the end yeah. anyhow. Yeah. yeah. So then uh, drawing happens. Okay, and then we're into winter. Woo. I will take a piece of hardwood. Uh, right there. I will also take a piece of hardwood. Um, I got some over there. Oh, sorry. I'm going to take a piece a, of softwood. Woo! Yeah. Uh, then we go here. So cutting, transport. Oh, so I, I, I can't transport this down, though. Yeah, you can. Oh, yeah. oh you got a sled. Yeah, you got yeah, a sled. sled. Yeah, so, yeah. So, yeah. So I move that down with this guy. Yeah. And then um, I cut with these two. Yeah. So I'm gonna use one of my mill workers from my my yeah. huts to get two pieces of firewood up here. Can I get a black uh, hardwood, please. And uh, I'm gonna use this guy. I can still use him to get wood yeah. there. So I'll use him to take these two boots. Uh, I will use this guy, use him to my sled, and one extra food to transport three. Yeah. So boom, boom. This is where if I have one and more saw. And I'm using this and my sled to transport two, but I can also use two, four, six, eight, nine, two Ooh, more so food Three. to transport two additional ones. Then we go into sawing. I will use my, my mill worker, my saw, saw this up into... I'll use my last guy this and my last saw. Yeah, see, I could have took that one with the dollar that I had yeah. to, to buy, but I, I miscalculated the amount of money I had. So here's my I forgot that I, I was going to take five saws, and I forgot that I could only have a max of four. Okay, so, task. So now task. Who's a go here, and I might as well throw one up here to my joiner. Might as well. Might as well. And then we go to food. So I feed eight, seven plus the one for my joiner. Yep, I same. feed seven. And we heat, so I have my seven wood here. Seven wood. I. Now we go into final sale. So okay. you can sell all of one type of wood on the river. Uh, so I will sell that for nine bucks. And then this is twelve, fifteen dollars here. Six, 13, 
17. And then I'll sell these for three apiece, so that's another six bucks. One for that. Five for that. 15. Take, and then up here it's... Take 20. And then that gets plus three. So two plus three, so that's five. And this one's worth four dollars uh, for me. Yeah, see, I could have got an extra 12. <laughs> well, are, no, well, are we doing the tasks now as well? Are you counting the tasks? Um, yep, now okay. add in your Four task times. value. 65. Alright, my favorite part. Doing the main game count. Can you hand me some 10s? Uh, there's have? only one 10 left. Oh. I just I just did I, it in my head, yeah. I just counted these up. Oh, and I made them worth twenties. Oh, you have some pretty high. No, I got sixty-five total there. Sixty-five. Yeah. Oh, yeah. So we're just adding them. Yeah. On. yeah. Okay. So, okay. Cool. So sixty-five. Eighty-five. Ninety. Ninety. Wow, that's a pretty good score. Wow. Well, yeah, I don't know. <laughs> so this is uh twenty forty sixty here. This is one hundred and seven. And a gentleman seventy four. Yeah, uh, 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 good game, guys. So even even with the this lost saw, even with that lost saw, you you were able to use the efficiencies of the planning to make a power turn to yeah. do like you, yeah to, to that yeah that was all this like turn right here yeah like yeah. like all the cutting and cutting stuff. five into. 30? Yeah, it was huge. 30 bucks. Yeah. I, I Well, I got seven for my firewood for the end of the year, plus having just $23. Yeah. I mean, that's that's pretty huge. Oh, that's huge, yeah. And then, like, this storeroom, for example, like, I wanted to do a food strategy. Oh, actually, I get uh, three more bucks. Oh, yeah, as do I. Uh, for, my, uh, for my office. So it's plus three for... So you have yeah, five more. I, I never did this. Yeah, so my total was 95 then? Yeah, 95. So yeah, uh, Joe, this is your first game. What did you think? Uh, it, it was good. Uh, you definitely have to play it a couple times to get used to how you can use the planning. I think that's definitely where I lost a, a lot of opportunity to make a little bit more money. Um, I, I just I didn't pay attention to it at all at the start of the game, yeah. and then I was using it when it wasn't even usable. Yeah, because um, normally like by here, you're like, okay, I'm starting the flow of the game now. But your number three token, that has to go out three turns later. Yeah. So if you don't put it out here, well, that doesn't trigger to winter. There's not a whole lot of the cards that trigger in winter. So, yeah, the, your first game is definitely uh, a learning game. Oh, absolutely. And, yeah, and, and I think seeing how you guys used it, you're able to identify for your future plays that, okay, hey, listen, you, you need to be mindful of these and where they're going to be using Because, like, you only beat David by 15 points or so. Yeah. And you got 23 of oh, those. Oh, wait a all second. From Minus my loan. Oh, yeah, minus oh, yeah. my seven. Yeah, yeah, minus my seven. So that puts me at 88. And that Sorry. puts me down at uh, 103. Yeah. But I think, yeah, <laughs> seeing how to use these can go a long way as well. Yeah, I think. And I see, still have 74, in case you're wondering. Yeah. yeah. In case you're keeping count. <laughs> you did not get a loan. No. I did not get a loan. Well, I think we also showed that, you know, taking a loan isn't the end, end no, of the game. No, exactly, yeah. yeah. And um, making a mistake's not the end of the game. Yeah. yeah. Like, you're going to, uh, like the designer said, there's going to be very few games where you're like, I, did. I played it. Played it perfect. Yeah. yeah. Like even like there were times I was like, oh, I should have bought. Well, I should have bought that one saw there. I should have hired. Like uh, during that last phase, I had an extra bear, and I didn't use this guy at all. Yeah. So that was a dollar, dollar I could have saved. So if you're you're just getting extra dollars here and there, Ooh. plus realizing like it's kind of like an investment, right? You want to invest the money that you have back into the back into the board to make you more money. Mm -hmm. Even if you got to spend three bucks to make one extra dollar. You still profited you that one extra dollar. Yeah. Well, and the other thing too is I find I'm usually do a pretty good job of keeping track of what other people are doing, like stealing your building materials or getting it, so sort of forcing you to go there. But on the last round, I was so anxious to get this task, and I didn't actually stop to consider if you guys were actually anxious as well, because the previous round you guys both went and got the tasks, right. and you were kind of set up for what you wanted to do. So. Um, and the. I probably left a couple. Points on the table. There. I like how the the three different phases of the game. I, I think they feel very different, and they provide a different experience. Like that picking your your area where you're cutting. That sets the tone for how fast you want to move through here and when you want to to arrive. Then you have this kind of evaluating what other people want and trying to pick. Well, can I jump over this? Can I grab this and still get this later on? And then there's kind of just like a, a little puzzle 
that you play kind of solo in the third phase where you're you're cutting, you're moving your stuff around. Do I want to sell this? Do I want to put this up into firewood storage? So you get three different phases that kind of have a different feel. Well, what I love about the first phase actually is like when we first couple of times we played it, we felt even if we went on the same spot, we go, okay, I win a race to get that. But in later plays, I've been if we go on the same spot, then I look at the spot that hasn't been chosen. Yeah. You're like, well, no one went for the hardwood. Yeah. So yeah, maybe if I drag world, my right? feet. Yeah. I can still pick up that hardwood. It'll yeah. cost me a dollar, but I'll get that hardwood and you won't. And I'm not going to leave it on the table for the next round for someone yeah. to, to go pick up afterwards because next round might be in two different spots and then you know. Well, and, and two, the, the other thing about the planning in this game is you need to, like you're saying, you need to be thinking ahead of it. How can you combo those things together? You can't grab three task cards at once. No. So you, in the early rounds, you're like, oh, that, that's a dollar that I can't use to buy other stuff. But you still need to be picking them up because if you only start focusing on them here, you're only going to get a couple right. yeah. uh, there. So you always got to be thinking thinking ahead, which I, I really like in this game. So yeah, overall, really, really like this uh, game. Mm -hmm. Thanks, everyone, for, for joining us. The designer said, uh, wow, great play. Thanks again for doing this. Very well done. Yeah, well, well thanks thank a lot for tuning thanks, in. Yes, yes, and thanks for designing a wonderful game. Yeah. Yes, indeed, indeed. So, um, yeah, we look forward to more plays. But, yeah, that was a great game, guys. Thanks All right, for, thank thanks you, fun, and we'll see you guys next time. See ya.